Hi, uh, this is Rizwan from Cybertech Lighting. I just wanted to show uh, show you all about how to connect our battery backup units. The battery backup is already in installed when we ship it to you. Um, there are some models that we don't install it, but uh, in this particular one, when we install it, we'll have it set up where we would have a few different connections. One would be the battery that needs to be installed. When, after, you set, after you do the installation, you need to connect the battery, so that will start charging the battery. There is a switch power connection or switch power input. So if, there is a, if you need to switch this unit on and off or on a timer, you would go into this. All you need is the hot, the neutral is already taken care of through the emergency battery. This is the emergency uh, driver power that comes in. So this is this power cannot be through a switch. It has to be prior to a switch, or it has to have its own direct line. So it has to have constant power, and it says constant power input. Uh, one way to check that everything is done all right is once you have the unit before you uh, you install anything or uh, and uh, attach the power, you can plug in the battery, and the battery plugs in, and. Once you plug in the battery, if the battery has juice, and sometimes we do have some that have juice, we don't plug in the battery. When we ship it out to you, you'll see the light turn on, which means that there, the, the battery is it's operating on the battery. Right now, since there's no power coming in, the unit is sensing that there is no power. It's running off the battery. That's how you check it. Again, so this would be a, an input for the, through the switch. This is constant power. Those two inputs need to be put in. You don't need to put a neutral here. The neutral going through here will we'll take care of the neutral and that. And this is then connected. It's a battery and everything is good. Install it and uh, put it all together. Thank you very much.